Dynamark, get ready, he's it, go. Dark. Kelly's here. Wow. Kelly's here. Perfect. Gaming. That's amazing. Lights action, people. Stage, get ready. It's lights camera action. Let's get ready now. Who has a microphone? Why mm -hmm. is this not centered? Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> well, I don't want to hear it in front of my face the whole time. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Sorry. Welcome back, everyone, to another episode of Fire Emblem Engage. I'm Kelly. I'm Zelly, and we're gaming here today as Vander. We're right now going to be completing the paralogues before we go to chapter 20. So the first paralogue we're going on is Roy's here. Last chapter, we went to the give report and we were able to find out that everybody on the Illusion Coast has perished or turned into ghouls or corrupted. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah that, oh no. Was, that was hilarious. Let me go into a house. Oh, let's get ambushed by more yeah, that corrupted. Was fun. <laughs> I was really hoping to see there actually be people there, but there were not actually people there. Uh, so right now, yeah, I uh, I went off stage a little bit and then I just leveled up Vander a little bit more. But only Vander. Everybody else has remained the same, so no big deal there. Sapphire, I was going to level her up, but I do not want to right now. I think everybody else leveled up will uh, pull me through, pull us through. Yeah. So we'll be good. Well, let's begin. So Roy. Roy's our boy. That's a model they used in Smash Brothers when they used Roy as a character. Oh, did they? It's one of the cheering symbols for it. Paralog the young lion. Yeah. Where are we? I don't recognize it. It looks like... No, it couldn't be. Roy, do you know this place? I may be seeing what I want to see instead of what's truly there. But it's very similar to a place where I once fought an important battle. Oh, do you mean in the world you're from? Could you tell me about it? I stood there, my allies at my side, facing down the armies of the Kingdom of Burn. The enemy's commander was Murdoch, who was especially strong. Tactically and physically, his battle axe. The power and weight of its blows are etched forever in my memory. Ooh. It was a battle so grueling, I can hardly believe that I or anyone else managed to survive. Hardcore. Hmm. But bitter as it was, I hold fond memories of that day as well. Hmm. It must be an important point in time for you. He talks really well. Mm -hmm. Yes, you could say that. I admit I feel a bit energized standing here. Would you grant me an odd request? Battle me here, in this place. Battle you? But why? This place is from my memory, but I believe it is a trial meant for you. Achieve a glorious victory against me, and our bond will grow deeper still. My power will grow, and yours will too. Are you interested? All right. I'll fight you, and I'll win. Hmm. <laughs> oh, we'll see about that. Yeah, so the only reason why Fogato, uh, Vander, and... Um, could get to at the bottom because I used them last in a map I previously used. Oh, I just figured you you had a, you know how you can sit down and eat with them. I figured it might have been from that maybe. Oh, that that would have been a nice thought. <laughs> that would have been very nice actually. All uh, right, what do we got? Ooh, we got a worm on the map. The giant circle. We do. Yeah. Oh, the, we do. The big circle is the wormy. You think it's a worm? Huh? It could be something else. No, I'm pretty sure it's a, a worm. So looks like we have a lot of riders here for worm riders, dragon riders. Some mages up here, level ten, level eleven. Uh, armor units along with their archer down here too. So they have a good mix of of characters actually. Uh, blue, more mages over here too. Bullock no, so that's a big, big town here. Ooh. Well look at that guy, he's big. Phantom worm. Alright. More flyers. Then Roy is lastly over here in the Citadel, or whatever this place is. It looks like a shrine almost. Mm -hmm. Binding blade. Alright. Uh, famous sword wielded by Emblem Roy. Grants defense and resistance plus five. Can strike close or at range. Uh, Lance Reaver, usual sword. Grants advantage versus lances, but disadvantage versus axes. So it's the opposite of what swords are actually advantages here. Because usually swords are weak to lances, which are blue. Yeah. And they're strong against axes. But in this case, this is the opposite where they're good against lances and they're bad against axes. I mean, I'm sorry. They're good against lances and then bad against axes. Interesting. Yeah. And then Worm Slayer. It's just good against dragons. All right. All right, Zelly, who's going to be on our team this time? Well, let's see. So they have a lot of flying units. I really think I should bring some archers this time around. Mm. Um, so we could, I definitely want to bring Anna. 
I don't know. You She's say that every mechanic. time, and then you don't end up using her. Or she just, I will use her. She ends up dying. I will use her. She will be used. She will be loved. Uh, we don't really have many... You know what? We only have the one mage, and we have... Legato. Let's bring in... Uh, let's bring in Fram. Here we go. Alright, so let's swap places now. I think every everything for inventory is good to go now. Just have to... Swap places. So Yonaka will be here. Yeah, all your... All your wizards have stabs. Everyone has a healing potion because we know how that usually goes. Yeah, yeah, they do. <laughs> Supposedly. I'm looking forward to seeing how you approach this battle. Oh, I thank you, Roy. I really like his voice. He does sound nice. <laughs> Defeat Emblem Roy, Vander's defeated. Let's go. You know, if I wonder if I just did auto battle and just advance in a balanced way. This oh, right. It's going to have everybody transform. Yeah, you forgot about that part, didn't you? Emblem Engage! Auto battling. Emblem, <laughs> engage! Cool. You can skip it if you want. No. <laughs> I would never want to skip that. Oh, Ooh. wait a minute. Okay, I did skip that because I screwed up and animations are turned off. I know, Zelly always plays with the animations off when he's off screen. the sound of huge wings? It sounds like wyverns. They might be reinforcements for Roy's troops. I should advance with caution. Thanks for the tip, Vander Jr. Oh, yes. Thank you very much for the tip. I could always use a good tip to my spear. Oh. He went to system. There you go. There you go, boy. Wait a minute. What? Um, settings. Oh, I went, went to the wrong you setting. Went to God. <laughs> I can fight. So in Smash Brothers, it was a really big competition usually between Mark and Roy. Beginning. As a character, people would this like to use a lot. Here we go. This time, victory was no. mine. Usually, say with Roy is our boy, and Marth. I don't know what they would say, but they would say something. <laughs> so, is on. is Roy's character from an older Fire Emblem game, Zelly? Um, you could say that. Yeah, he is from an older game. Like how old we talk and do? Like one of the first ones. Ooh. Like was it like on the PlayStation One or Two? I no, this is like Game Boy Advance. They were never on the PlayStation. Oh, yeah, they were mainly built on the uh, Game Boy Advances at first. So going through Nintendo, and uh, yeah, so it's it's been quite a ride. I mean, they've been they've made so many games. Is there any Fire Emblem game that you would say that stands out apart from the rest of them? Mm. Shall I go? The Divine Dragon looked at me. I don't know. I don't know if I could be impartial. Well, I think my def my definitely my favorite was probably Birthright. Yeah, Birthright's an amazing game. I love Birthright. Uh, I'm trying to think of which one had the most impact. I think the first one I played was with uh, Ellie Wood, Hector, and Lynn. So you know Lynn? Yes, I, I played her game. Oh. Quick change. So in that game, they had three heroes. It was Lynn, Hector, and Ellie Wood. So Ellie Wood was a champion with a sword. Hector was a champion with an axe. There was no champion with a spear for blue. But mm. then there's Lynn with an arrow. Mm. Yeah. She was cool. She was definitely one of my favorites, even though I liked, I think, Ellie Wood just a little bit more. Sanction. Oh, Yunaka. Zoko, let's go. Ooh, crush. So, I'm not a child anymore. You're not? That's right, Yunaka. You're a grown woman. <sighs> a full grown woman. Hmm. That says hi, Papaya. <laughs> hi, Papaya. And hi. Zappy. <laughs> hi, Papaya. How you doing? <laughs> Got an old man throwing some wind over here, blowing some wind. You know, it would be funny if Yunaka had a child and just called him Zabby. Zabby! <laughs> It'd be her catchphrase and her child at the same time. <laughs> yeah, Zabby definitely sounds more like a, a good name to have. All right, we're just going to bring everybody yeah. up. Eddie, I think, should be... No, Eddie's a glass cannon, too. I forget. All the archers are pretty much glass cannons, essentially. Mm -hmm. Your orders? There's none that can really withstand a lot of damage. <laughs> uh, and then Sadal the will just have to move up. I've never heard that reference before. Glass cannon? Yeah. I say that just because oh, glass cannon means you're all about offense, but you have no defense. Ooh. So I when people say, that. so that's the term you would use like in World of Warcraft and stuff. Oh. Yeah. Here's Zelly's nerdy side coming out. <laughs> a little bit. So I'm then ready. a tank is like a tank in real life, right? What do you think of when it comes to saying a tank? 
that they're like impenetrable, like very good defense. They're very tough, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's exactly what a tank is. So a tank in like the multiplayer online game would leave you uh, very strong in defense abilities. Oh man, Vander. Oh, not a crit. It's okay. She might be in trouble. She keeps getting hit like this. Come on, Sapphire, I'm giving you a chance here. Don't don't let me down. Reinforcements. Uh-oh. More flyers. They're coming for us. I have to finish this quickly. I'm gonna do a range attack to take out the one wyvern here. He said to retreat. Wyvern? It's not wyvern. Sorry, he said it is wyvern, right? I should have been saying that. <laughs> oh, I feel so bad. Making Brodia proud. All right. Oh, level two. I said pretty plus seven. I have corn attached to her right now just to help. Because corn pretty much lowers their defense abilities, which is great. Um, so that I can do more damage, essentially. Let's go with Lynn. Now that Lyndon's actually up to stuff now, he's actually a capable old man. <laughs> yeah, you're saying he's not even capable beforehand. He might have been in the religious studies, but not in battle practice, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> no way, no way, Jose. But Eddie here, she's gonna take him out A-OK. -okay. 5% crit. Will it happen? Nope. That's right. So right now, Eddie's in cover, so I think she'll be able to avoid them just fine. Their hit's only 104. So, neat little fact, if you take the person's hit against their avoidance, gives you the chance of them actually hitting you. So I think that's how this works in this game. Since I have an avoidance of 102 and they have a hit of 104, their chance to hit me is going to be 2%. Okay. <laughs> so they won't be able to hit me? Or they shouldn't be able to. Emblem. If they do, I'm going to be quite sad. Let's go, Zaka. <laughs> Do they ever, like, in Fire Emblem games, like, have, like, an after story of, like, what happens to all the characters once, like, the battling and the wars are all over? Yeah, they do. Sometimes they do. Uh, they usually say, like, the people go back to their villages that they were recruited from. Dream well. Or they go on to pursue the world in more passions. Or that, you know, something comes up. So they, they usually talk about it, though. You're right, though. Yeah, kind of like in um, Triangle Strategy, you remember that? Oh, yeah. So long ago. Uh, but yeah, in Fire Emblem, essentially everybody kind of goes back oh, to the their main objective. So like, Jean wants to be a doctor, right? Mm -hmm. So he'll probably keep pursuing that. Uh, and Sadal will probably still be a dancer for the royal family. Kagetsu will probably still be with Lucia. Uh, all kind of stuff like that. I mean, most of them are from their respective kingdoms. I'd like to think they'd go back to their own lands. <laughs> right. What about this dance, though? Oh. I will say whenever you have someone equipped with that particular animal, I just love the purple hair. <laughs> Violet's? Yeah. Yeah, Violet is amazing. Violet is so cool. So check this out. Killing Edge has a 47% chance to crit, so mm -hmm. I have half a chance to crit. I might just take him out in one shot. We'll see. Nope. Nope. See, so has a 3% chance to hit me for 2 damage. Mm. Oh, I feel so good to hit those numbers. Uh oh. Right. I think I'll be okay. <laughs> I say that unknowingly. Because Yunaka is a flying unit right now. And there's another archer nearby. And I just put her in danger on purpose, so. We'll see if my stupidity pays out. <laughs> so see how long that, see how far Sigurd, uh, it's not Sigurd, uh, Clan can move. Wow. Or Fram. Fram. My goodness, you always get those two mixed up. I do. Uh, but, I mean, it's for good reason, though, too, because um, Sigurd allows the person whoever you're engaged with to move like a cavalry unit, mm -hmm. essentially. So you have huge movement ability. Cool. Yeah. It is cool, Kelly. Thank you. Finally, someone's appreciating Fire Emblem. By someone, I mean you, the viewer. You're appreciating this, right, too? What a 
joyous feeling. You know, I wonder if I can move Selena forward enough to... Oh, no, I can't. Oh, not quite enough. That's okay. Bring the archers over here, too. So we're going to have wyverns? Is that what they're called? Wyverns, right? I, I like to think that's how you pronounce it. You only had a 10% chance to hit, so... I'm not a child You anymore. looked out. I'm not a child. I am the divine and now we're there. Oh, oh yeah, 60, baby. Anymore. You see the way he flopped on the ground? Well, my shoulder... <laughs> his shoulder was kind of like lifted up for a moment. Like, to the ground. I won't falter. I won't falter. Another well, a 50% <laughs> chance for that one. Well, also the fact of... Oh. Please miss. No, nope, doesn't miss. We're gonna be okay with Sapphire. So she can retreat and still take out the Wyvern. Yeah, see how it's only 2%? Yeah, I guess that right. I may do that all along. Please don't have more wy Wyverns. Oh! oh, no! Oh! <laughs> No! This is terrible! Well... Well, 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 what do we have here? It's a bunch of wyverns sticking oh their noses where they don't belong. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna take them out. Oh yeah, Radiant Bow. Let's go. There, Anna finally got used after bringing you <sighs> into the battle. I know, right? After so many different battles, Anna actually becomes useful. Actually, I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna hold on my uh, my do my doubles right now. Let's see what happens. Oh God, damn, Lennon, you're spry. No one's critting. <laughs> it's because I will it, Kelly. Oh, I, Max. I will it. Okay, so we're gonna use steel bow. This guy right here. Yeah, that really surprised me though. They I came from all directions. <laughs> that really got me. I'm like. Hmm. This isn't so bad. Nope. This is uh. This is kind of bad actually. Now. There's reinforcements. Come get me. Huh. I'm really concerned about Sapphire now, actually. Yeah, I am too. Actually, they showed up like right next to her too. So I'll be okay to take these guys down, but I'm gonna have to really pull back and uh help out with Sapphire. Goblin, you're so cool. Curses upon our enemy. <laughs> this is such an old way saying. A thousand curses upon our family. I've got this. Do you? I don't know if you got this, sweetheart, because uh, looking pretty, pretty bloodied right now. Looking pretty concerned All right, right now. Let's uh, let's bring a few people back. Let's have the archers go back a little bit. Wait. Oh, I'm using a archery weapon, right? OK, gotcha. Let us move forward. Actually, Vanner should be able to come up here and I think grab the attention of these guys. Dream well. Yes, dream well. You idiots. I mean, oh yeah, dream well. Same when you knock. I think these guys should be able to handle them just fine. Crit. Time to finish the job. Yep. Crit. I feel like we should do something when we when we get a crit now. You know, like a saying or a phrase, like a chant. Mm. Crit. Crit. Crit, 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 crit. You used to say crit all the time and then there would be no crit. <laughs> I know. All right, let's see if Sephir can not get hit. There we go. Let's get the enemy. No one's gonna miss you. Wow. Ah, hardcore. Sephir, that's, that's, that's a bold move to say. Oh. 1%. Sleep Ooh, crit. I was asleep, so now you're asleep. How do you like it? I could use another blanket. <laughs> another blanket? Yeah. It's cold <laughs> on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> well, all those trees shading you from the from the sun. Uh -huh. Damn, Fram. I love her as a martial artist. I think this is so cool, in my opinion. All right, all right, all right. I think actually, I think she's gonna be okay. Oh yeah, this guy's close. Sweet! Stay focused. Have you ever wanted to move so fast in your life you just teleport? Yeah. Oh yeah. I know I have. 
Sometimes I wish I could just teleport to work. <laughs> That'd be nice, huh? <laughs> it's kind of like, I want to try to work, but I have to. Mm -hmm. God, I love that pose. I'm not a child anymore. <laughs> or if she kills anything, it only gets two SP. <laughs> Knife Precision 3. I know you know this, Zelly, but I love being chauffeured everywhere I go. I know you do. <laughs> and I like doing it. Oh, do you know? Sometimes. Sometimes, yeah. And then you're like, ooh, I get to ride today when I get to mm. drive. Mm hmm. Serve the creator. Kagetsu is definitely one of my strongest Should units. I, have held back? I think between him, Fogato, and Vanner, probably about my top three units, I think, right now. Mm hmm. I don't know why I attacked this one. I could have just had to let Sydney attack and kill this one off. <laughs> Look at me, my psycho laugh. I mean, <laughs> um. Yeah, I think Katetsu, you know, Kunaka, to and like Vander are my top three in my file. Tanaka. <sighs> Which one? Wait, Tanaka. The one, the sword, the sword guy you're just talking about. Kagetsu. Yeah, that one. Yeah. Yeah, he's definitely. Oh yeah, he's definitely upper tier. Okay, now we have to make sure that no more units come our way. So we're gonna just kind of go along the edge here, just keep following us through. Oh, just just you wait. There'll be more reinforcements coming our way. <laughs> Kelly, don't you start. I don't want your sass here. You're taking too long. They're gonna send more reinforcements. I'm not trying to, for God's sake. <laughs> <laughs> if I were, I'd just fall back and let the worms come to me. The wyverns. Not the worms. <laughs> you want more worms to show up? <laughs> I wouldn't mind some more worms. Be quite frank, though. I mean, that was kind of scary that one time they all showed up, though. Like, oh, yeah, no big deal. All right, Celine, get into it. She has a 1% chance to crit. No. Oh, Ignis, though, activated. So, Ignis is an ability that she has that. If, uh, let's go over here. Wait, I can't look at it. No, you can't. Ah. Just tell me about it. So eventually if Ignis procs, there's a chance that it procs and you get an additional stat boost to the, uh, whatever you're doing. So when it says you're going to do 17 damage, you will most likely do more than that. I'll begin this. Depending on the situation. Ooh. Oh, yeah, come on, breathe it on me. <laughs> Just kidding, one hit me. I am guided by the emblems. I bet that worm would have had frozen steaks. <laughs> frozen steaks? Yeah. Oh, heck yeah. Yeah, what up? Or maybe ghost steaks because it was a phantom worm. <laughs> a phantom worm? Is that what you're thinking of? Yeah. Worms? Can you just make them after just chopping them up and eating them? Oh, there's carcasses left over the battle? Oh, we need, we need mm. the meat to go on to the next battle. Let's... <laughs> Let's raid the enemy corpses of Wyvern. Let's raid the enemy corpses. Doesn't that sound psychotic? Let's raid the enemy Wyverns. I mean, at least they're not like cannibals of eating human flesh or anything. Like I think you've been watching too much of that food dungeon anime. Is that what it's really called? I don't know what it's called. It's a delicious I think dungeon. I thought, oh, that is that is the name, I believe. Yeah. That sounds right, anyway. Yeah. Oh. It is a good show, so if you guys are watching this too, I would definitely recommend it. That's a good series. It's on Netflix. It certainly is. Hey! I can still do more. Why did I bring my worm that flies to work today? Ow. Oh. Ah, <laughs> oh, nuts. You're making me think of the guy who would take the river to work. <laughs> He'd wear like a full like swimsuit, like bodysuit, and then he had his clothes and he'd change his suit, like once he got out of the river and he was completely dry because of the wetsuit kept kept him dry. That was pretty clever that when he did that, I'm like, huh, that's a that's a, not a bad strategy actually. I kind of wish sometimes there was a river to, but where we live so we could just take the river to work. <laughs> Would it be great instead of having to use roads, you could just use rivers or natural resources? If only it weren't so cold here in Wisconsin. That's okay. It's not cold all the year, at least. Yeah. And quite frankly, the years of Wisconsin, um, years have become less chilly and more frequent. Yeah, so like... So they haven't been as long. Like, even, like, the winter we've had, it hasn't been that bad this year. It's been pretty light. Oh, yeah. It's probably been more, like wet slushy stuff than anything else and then it's just melted right away right 
Okay, so right now we have one more flyer over here, and then we're pretty much gonna advance everybody uh, to the next stage over here. Are you gonna auto advance, or you don't want to chance it? <laughs> I'm gonna do it after this one. Cause yeah. this. I'm pretty tough, you know. I shot an arrow with light magic. Oh my god, I'm so cool. I'm so nerdy. Okay, so we're still in advance. Hopefully, people don't just use their emblems right away. Oh, good, they can't. <laughs> That's on cooldown. <laughs> uh, you know what? I think I'll just advance once again, actually. We can get them through the wall. <laughs> oh! Oh, it it twice? Oh, yeah. Do you see how he sexily swung around like that? Wow. God, he's so sexy. I love him. I love the bushy tail. Yeah. He's part furry, part human. That butt. <laughs> tail butt? Yeah, tail butt. Uh, tail butt, uh, yeah. Meteor, what? That's something we haven't seen before, I don't think. I am sure I haven't seen that attack before. So Meteor is a higher, higher grade item. Oh, Roy's going all out. Ooh, oh my god. This man crits oh. all day long. Oh my god. No damage. Oh, that's right, Roy's ability. Oh, no! <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Why you must it's, be like this? It's the map saying that you're taking to life. <laughs> no, it's because I advanced so far. The map's like, oh, oh. Is that what it is? God, you're so quick. We have to rush in all the units now because we're so progressive. Put it again. <laughs> man, Zelkov is just taken like this like a walk in the park. Yeah, he is. I freaking love that man. I mean, what? <laughs> He's a good guy. Being a boss. I'd love him. Oh, do you know? I would love, I would love to love him. What? I love him. I, I love you more, though, yeah, as, you as your him. wife. That's cool. Those little clothes like dark and mysterious, you know? But that doesn't mean you'd want to be intimate with him. No, not like that. I just want to be a fanboy, okay? You, 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 you want to be a fanboy? I want to be a fanboy of Zalkov. Good to know that you've clarified on that subject. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, Kelly. Boy, if I didn't clarify, I'd be in oh. for quite a surprise. Wait, can I attack it from here? I totally can. Sweet. Lord Roy? Is there not someone more, um, uh, adequate you should be fighting? <laughs> oh, wow. Why are you talking nonsense, Alchrist? Yeah, Alchrist. You are the Prince of Brodia, the land I was entrusted to. Who better could I face? Diamant. Exactly. Let our battle begin. Be a man! Diamant, the worthier brother. <laughs> Hold out. Plus three. Wow, that guy is something else, I tell you. Well, I don't think I could take him out. I don't think anybody else can. All right, well, we gotta go. <laughs> so Doll's left all the we way back go. here. We gotta go. I don't want to be attacked in the butt. Yeah, I don't want to be attacked <gasps> in the butt, like what Kelly said. Oh, yeah, it's kind of like uh, the Shrek movie where he. Oh. That's not good. <laughs> where he well, got. I'm gonna hide in the bush and hope they don't see me. Stuck in his butt and Fiona had to pull it out for Shrek. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Actually, Sapphire might be able to take them out. You seem much more focused, more intense than usual. My sword, the Binding Blade, was kept in this land for centuries. My memory of retrieving it must be granting me additional power. Ooh. If a memory can grant power, then I'll give you a fight we'll both remember. If a memory gives you more power, I can't Ooh. wait to see what happens when Banner Jr. gets all his memory back. Right. So Sapphire will be able to hold out. I almost want her to take out another wyvern and like, take out Roy. You know, she might be able, she might be worthy leveling up after all, Kelly. Oh, maybe not. I don't know. I don't know. I think that's a bit ambitious to kind of drag her all the way over there to defeat Roy. <laughs> Especially when you got some some wyverns on your tail. Right. Okay, Sapphire. This is your glory days. Okay. Better stand. This is where you destroy. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah. To go two. Out of the way. Oh my god, Dragon Fang! Roar! Awesome. Oh my god, I had more gold. Thank you. Woo! 
Woo! And I leveled up a level 11. Ooh. And you didn't want to level her up. Yeah. Hey. She seems pretty strong to me. I mean, she's she's okay. She's she's doing well. It's no, no. different with you and the old man with the mage. Don't oh, bite me. I'm crippled and old. You won't be able to use me. He's got balls of steel now. He has cojones of steel. <laughs> this old man can quite break a feather. <laughs> this man has gone stronger with his magic. I can blow a meteor out of the sky with one single spell. You see that? My fingertip did that. <laughs> Poof! It's gone now. Why? Because the great mage Linden is here. Ready to screw up everything. I mean, what? Free <laughs> 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 to get and, and save everyone. That's oh, what I meant to say. Sure it was. Uh-huh. All right, so... <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm just, uh, oh, he's not, uh, he's not Len anymore. Ah, oh, darn it. Attack. Let well, this be over. All right. Uh, oh, you know uh, what, though? There's a, there's a unit in the court. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's get this knight. He's like, I don't want to do anything. He, they won't know me if, if they can't see me. <laughs> just kidding. Oh, zero percent chance. Let's go. I thought you could oh, hide from us. Give me strength. Not. Never. It's not never a good time, you know. Never say never. Oh, I can't. I can't go past I'll this. I'll manage. Well, then move Vander so then he can move in front of the other guy. Well, fine, I'll do that, Kelly. Is this Alcrest? Oh! Alcrest, you can't get him. Nobody can get him. Ooh, Yunaka could, though. I guess you can do it that way. Yunaka, take him out. I order you to take him out. Allow me. I Nope. Oh, just kidding. It was Alco. <laughs> Allow me. <laughs> Don't you hate when your thunder gets taken away by someone? I just thought for sure that Zelko would be the MVP. Yes. No, Vanner was way too, way too big of a dragon prince. He went up there and gobbled everybody up. Nom, 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 Thank nom, you nom, for nom. entertaining my wish to fight. You're impressive. You would have won if I'd slipped up even once. I never want to have you as an enemy again. Please, you're embarrassing me. <sighs> What's wrong, Roy? You're staring. No, oh, it's just that you remind me of somebody I once knew. Her name was Edun. She was a demon dragon. And King Zephiel of Burn wished to use her to destroy humanity. Mm. A demon dragon? Like you, each of her eyes was of a different color. And she carried herself a bit like you, too. I never knew there was such a person. Hmm. Did you battle this demon dragon? Well, I had a choice. Kill her and wipe out the dragons. Or save her, the enemy of mankind. Can you guess which I chose? Which was it? I'll tell you the whole tale once this war is over, and your world is at peace. Aww. <laughs> okay, then. <laughs> but you have to promise me you'll tell. I'm looking forward to the story. I promise. Until that day comes, I think we'll enjoy our time together. Let's go back and see Roy's story. No, nope, just kidding. Right. <laughs> I wish. I think in that game, though, I think for that Fire Emblem game, you could choose, like Roy was saying, Max Bond level unlocked. So, yeah, you could choose to slay the dragon, so save humankind, mm -hmm. or choose not to kill the dragon and save the dragon, essentially. So they were essentially being brainwashed. They're being kind of like what Vale is right now. Mm -hmm. And so the only way to, to deal with them at that time was to literally kill them. Oh, that's is sad. Like the only option. Yeah, because well, there wasn't an option, I don't believe, at the time. Hey, Roy. That's great. You grew a lot stronger during this battle. I felt almost as proud as if it were me. How cute. Thanks, Dad. You're the best. I mean, what? No. Vander Sr. is my father. <laughs> Vander Senior. <laughs> or he sure acts like a father figure. Can you imagine if he like you talk to him as well while I'm sleeping? He's like, we should call him Vander Jr. We, we do call our character Vander Jr. sometimes. I know I'm giving this story lore some plot to it. <laughs> Vander, you're the father? Oh, what? Plot twist. <laughs> what? You and Lamera? You guys hooked up? But isn't she like, like 500 years old and you're like, you know, 70? Aren't you? The different spectrums here? Like, what's going on? Who is she? Sheepy! We're gonna adopt the sheep. 
I'm back to the boat. <laughs> All right, let's go to depart. Ah, uh, now Roy's level 20. Good. You know, I have a lot of bond fragments I've been meaning to use. Oh, have you now? Uh-huh. Mm. I sure have. Ooh, bond conversations unlocked. Well, thank you for joining us here today. I've been Zelly. And I've been Kelly. And we went just through the biting grounds to get Emblem Roy to level 20. Thank you for joining us here today. Enjoy us next time as we continue the story here on Fire Emblem Engage. If you like the series so far, give a like down below. And thanks for watching. See you the next one. Bye bye. Bye. Hey Kelly, they stayed to the end. I know, Zelly. I think they like us. Like, like subscribe, or share to show us you care. Bye bye.